What's up everyone? Welcome back to Northern NM Living. So today we're gonna try a claim that warm water, rubbing alcohol, and Dawn dish soap will melt ice. We're here at a job site where we poured new concrete about a month ago and it snowed and now uh, it's melted and it's frozen and it snowed again and so we've got about three inches in some area of ice. So we're gonna mix up some dish soap, rubbing alcohol, and some warm water and see if this works. So I'm gonna bring you guys in closer so you can see how we're gonna mix this. Okay, so this is a sprayer here and it's one of them sprayers for bleach or um, disinfectant, kind of like a bug sprayer. They say, now I got 91% regular dollar store alcohol. They say you're supposed to put two tablespoons. To me that doesn't seem like it's enough. I don't understand how two tablespoons in half a gallon of water will work. So this is what we're going to do. are going to add half a cup of alcohol. Okay, so there's about half a cup of 91% rubbing alcohol into warm water. Now we're going to get Dawn dish soap. We even used Dawn, they said it was Dawn, and you're supposed to use a tablespoon, we're going to kind of just guesstimate, that was probably more like five tablespoons, okay, I'm going to use the wand to mix it all up. Right now it's about 27 degrees, so it is freezing. This is not meant to prevent ice. It's meant to melt ice. So let's see. Okay. See if this really does work. Okay. Okay everyone, so it's been about 10 minutes and as you can see it it does melt it definitely. But if you're thinking that you can spray this on there, wait 10 minutes, 15 minutes, sweep it or shovel it off, that's not going to happen. We sprayed it uh, all over and it is melting it. It is. For sure it is. I would say this is more of a spray it uh, in the morning when it starts warming up and leave it there till the evening before it gets cold again maybe sweep it shovel it off and I, I'm pretty sure it'll melt a lot of it away 
it is not a you know throw spray it on and ice will be gone in an hour um, that is not gonna happen so we're gonna try something else here all this material this is all trim material that is frozen to the concrete we're gonna dump the mixture on it instead of spraying it just and see if that makes a difference by now the water isn't warm it's probably it's not cold but <clears throat> it isn't warm so uh, we're gonna dump the solution over there and make another batch of solution and try it again and dump it out this time and see if that works better so you guys in tight on this shot here so you can see right there where we dumped it give you guys a good shot here hope you guys can see that you can see the soap bubbles there it's pretty well frozen um, it will not come up easily I'll show you guys here We'll just let that sit there, make another batch and see what happens. Okay, so it's been about 15 minutes where we dumped the whole can, the whole bottle of solution. As you can tell, it started melting it along the trim material there. All that was frozen up against the that material, that brown material. Uh, it's the drip edge for the roof and in about 15 minutes you can tell that it started to melt the ice and releasing uh, that trim so it, it does work a little faster um, but you do have to let it sit so it definitely does work it just doesn't uh, work as fast as you would hope so okay guys so as you can see it melted enough by dumping it on it to release all that material that was frozen to the concrete sorry I didn't uh, record but all, all we did was pick it up it wasn't held down at all so um, it's right now it is still about 27 degrees um, so it's melting the ice and there's the material there we're gonna let the Sun hit that there and dry it up dry up all that uh, drip edge so um, there you go definitely it works Okay, so it's been about an hour and a half, and it's soaked. We let it soak in, and you can tell that it did start melting. It doesn't work fast. But uh, this is really thick ice over here <clears throat> in the areas where it was thin. It removed the ice down to the concrete. And uh, 
Now it's breaking up real easy. It's not a fast process at all, but it does work. So, does alcohol, dish soap, and water melt ice? Yes, it does, but very slow. So, take your chances if you want, but doesn't. Okay, guys, so it, it works not, not all that well. As you can see here, um, that's pretty thick ice. Uh, the stuff that's like really thin, you know, it, that it does uh, melt away. So um, uh, it somewhat works. But if you're a contractor or you need to remove thick ice from stairs, walkway, sidewalk, concrete slab, I would recommend using uh, some other type of commercial or some other type of product that is specially designed and is safe for concrete and pets and plants or whatever. Um, set, like I said, uh, Safe Paws is a good material. I've used it once and it's safe and it does melt the ice um, really well. And that's what we'll spread on this here uh, today so that we can get this ice melted off so we can uh, finish up this project. So if you haven't hit the subscribe button, do that now. Click on the thumbs up and we'll see you on the next video.